how to increase technical skills for non-technical scrum masters. So I would say, as someone who is doing technical job from last five, seven years, and you want the expert technical people for working on your product, and someone who is coming from zero technical background and assumes that I will be able to create that mindset and contribute here, though I am primarily a project manager, maybe too much high expectation from the person. At the same time, having some understanding of technical skills can make you empathize and understand the technical problems well. So you, if you, I'm, I'm a manager, I'm a leader, you call me scrum master, project manager, whatever, but I am expected to lead and facilitate a group of team members. Yeah? That's my role. I need to have an understanding so that I can ensure we are not taking shortcuts. I ensure quality. I can understand what is working, what is not working. And I can empathize with my people who are doing the work. I may not be able to solve their problem. I may not be an expert in solving their problem because I am not more skilled than, than them. I am less skilled in technology with, with, than them. And that's why I need to facilitate to solve the problem. Now, if I want to get some basic understanding so that I can facilitate and well, I can definitely do a, some amount of introductory program by taking some assistance. Whatever technology is getting used in a given target profile, you can take a, a, some kind of a program so that you understand the foundational part of it. It is also a good idea to do a shadowing with some of the team members for a while. Yeah? So you just be a part of one hour shadow, shadowing, two hour shadowing, where you just observe what the developer or the, the tester is doing. You may make a note and then you have a half an hour interaction where you can ask you know, why you did this, why you did that. And probably if you do five, 10 such sessions, uh, you will get a fair understanding what is happening in your team. Yeah? So a structured learning program for a given technology or doing shadowing with the technical people periodically, maybe taking some hours of education can help you in getting necessary skills, which helps you in empathizing with your development team.